Hello, let's continue our advanced Sudoku series with Death Star 2 by Philip Newman. Or is it Death Star 11? Hmm. Um, <laughs> so this continues our uh, trek through the Sudoku Gospel document. This is the fifth puzzle of chapter one. Chapter one being learning to fly. So it's all about wings. Now we're expecting more wings like I described in the last video. I'm going to be using some terminology like weak links and strong links. And if you don't know what that means, I highly recommend that you check out this video first. <clears throat> I'm going to link two videos up there. I know it feels like homework, but one of them is just like this video where I am solving the puzzle previous to this, and I go over what strong links and weak links are and what we're looking for with wings. Or if you want an even more in-depth discussion, you can look at the Sudoku discussion episode number one, which is all about strong links and weak links and goes through them very rigorously and lots of examples beyond just wings. So I'm going to assume you know some of that stuff, <laughs> that you, you kind of remember what we went over last video, so I don't have to explain it every video. I'm going to need those from now on. So I'm just going to add this disclaimer to the front of all of them. Um, and so yeah, in the description, you can check out the Stoical Gospel document. You can also check out a link to this puzzle if you want to try it yourself. And I'm going to get started right now. Okay. Um, we can't we can't fill the corners on this one. <laughs> By the way, Death Star, that's amazing. Like look at it. You can see the Death Star. It's awesome. Um are these like ships surrounding it or let's see. This is hard to scan though, because I just keep seeing Death Star. Um let's try to scan though anyway. We do have two sevens looking into here. So sevens on one of these two. I am also on the lookout for buy locals. Um and I will mark those if I see them. Three and five need to go somewhere. Three is by local. So we have a by local three right here. So I'm going to mark that in green. Mm -hmm. Fives are almost, not quite. Sevens we got. All right, let's look at this next band here. We have two nines looking in, and this nine looks down, so nines in one of these two. Whoa, I was still in color mode. There we go. Nines in one of those two. And I'm using this green just to designate, to, re to remind myself that these threes aren't for the boxes, it's for the row. And hopefully I remember that. Um, we have two ones looking up, so there's a one in one of these two. Five in one of these two. I feel like verticals are good here. Twos, threes, eights are in, uh, sorry, no, eights are over here. Uh, yeah. Anything else of note here? Um, I noticed these sevens, but it's three places. We need five and six in this row. So six, yeah, six is in one of these two. So let's mark that. I'll use purple for that. Why not? I think different colors is good to remind myself that those are connected and not to other things. Um, I need two, three, four in this row. Also in this column. Hmm. So I have this two, three looking in here and this two, three looking in here. So two, three are in these three cells, which is very unfortunate because it's not two cells. <laughs> um, do I have anything else to find here? Nines are up here. Um, what else can I do here? I might already be at looking for restricted cells. Ones, look up. So ones in one of these two. So every corner mark I have is related to a buy local in some way. Let's find if there's any buy values. Um, what are we? 
The twos are down here. Oops, meant a quarter mark. I'm trying to see what cells. So this can't be one, two, three, four, five, seven, nine. So this is six, eight. Um. This can't be two, three, four, five, seven. No. I'm trying to meta this a little bit. Oh wait, this five. Yeah, this five takes that seems purposeful. Let's make those blue. Five's in one of these two. We found a five by local here, connected to a seven by local. Um I don't know how to connect the bilocals we found so far, but they seem purposeful. Is there a bilocal over here that I didn't notice? The nine? The nine's up there. So three. Yes, three is bilocal. This three's not here. This three C's here. This three C's here. So there's a three bilocal in one of these two. We're starting to connect them. Ooh. So let's start drawing this out. So we have a strong link between these threes. We also have a strong link between these threes, and I don't know whether I want to... Let's start like we did last time and just start drawing all the strong links we've got. Because look, it's three to three to three here. So what can we already say? Strong, weak, strong. One of these threes must be true. That's, that's a two-string kite right there. But it sees this eight, <laughs> so there must be more going on. Um, is six, six is not limited. I was hoping six was limited to these two in this box, or three. Three is, okay. We got a lot going on with threes here. So in this box, this three looks in, this three looks in. So three is in one of these two in this box. So we have another strong link right here. So are we starting to maybe connect these? Is it that this can't be three? Strong, weak, strong, weak. We need another strong link on these threes. Because if this is a three, that can't be three. But if this is not a three, we have a three there. Which means that's not a three, which means you have a three there. Which means that's not a three. So we need another strong link on this three somehow. Um, it's not a three, six pair, is it? Or a three, six by value? Let's look at what it can be. Um, sorry, I need to, there we go. Um, can't be one, two, could be three, can't be four, looks like it could be five, six, can't be seven, it could be eight. So it's not a buy value. Are we connecting this three to this three? No, that doesn't, that doesn't do anything. Makes that not a three. We already know that's not a three. Hold on, why is this why is this a strong link? I don't think this is a strong link. I think I made a mistake. That is a weak link, but it's not a strong link. Whoa, I don't want to erase everything. Um this is just a weak link. And that's what's confusing about having the threes corner marked like that, but I don't know of a better way. But if I draw it out, then that really reminds me. So with this weak link here, I think we would want to use this as a weak link as well. And that's why we need another strong link on this three. Um, I'm not seeing it. What else can I find here? It, there, there, th this is intentional. These threes going around our, our, de our Death Star is very intentional. But I don't know what to do with it yet, so there must be more to find with this. Strong, weak, strong, weak. What could this have a link to? Six, okay, six is in this box, are in three places, darn. Maybe I'm missing some obvious deduction somewhere, and that's keeping me from seeing it. I'll look at threes again. This isn't one or two. 
So it's from four, five, eight. Doesn't seem helpful. Is there some is there some reason that this couldn't be five or eight? Is there like a hidden triple that I'm not seeing or something like that? Because we've got the we got the threes limited to these two, and then the six is limited to these three, which isn't really matching up. I've got the five looking in. Maybe I should pencil this middle cell here. It's, it can be two, can't be three, could be four, can't be five, six, could be seven or eight. Yeah, these aren't interesting cells. I feel like I'm on the verge of finding this thing. <laughs> By the way, I do think I know the name of this one. If it is, if it's all by locals, I think it's called an L wing. And I think that's what we're looking for here. But I don't know what to do at the end here. Maybe there's a by local in this box. Is that true? Not on threes, there's not. Unless there's something about threes here that I'm not understanding. Three in this box is. Hold on. Yeah, three in this box is in these three, and in this box is in these three. And this box is in these three. And then this box is here, and this box is here. No. Okay. Um. I noticed this column needs a one and a seven and a five. Okay, so what is this cell? It's not one, two, three. It could be four. It's not five, six, seven. It could be eight, not nine. I should pencil this cell to see because I've been this whole time I've been trying to eliminate three from it. But it can't be three anyway, so obviously we're targeting something else. So I think our our maybe our wing starts elsewhere. Does our wing start here instead? No, because this is not a strong link on threes. But like even if I proved that three had to be in one in somewhere, but it's gotta be it's gotta be somewhere up here that I'm trying to prove can't can't be three, right? Anyway, what can this cell be? It can be can't be one, two, three, four. It could be five, six, seven, or nine. Yeah. So like, why am I even thinking about that one? Kind of silly. Um, it does have a buy local six on it. There's some way to connect. Is this a three six? Like that would be interesting. I don't see how it could be one or two. One, two, three. It can't be six. One, two, three, five, seven. No, not seven. One, two, three, five. Mm, what have I missed? Is there a bi-local in this column? Is it the five again? Yeah. The five oh, the five is bi-local in this column. That's very suspicious. Uh what have I used? Red. So this five C's here, this five C's here, this five C's here. So there's a strong link between the fives. Weak. Huh. Oh, it. Five in this box, though, is not. Oh, five in this box, there's. Okay, so there's a strong link between these fives. There's a strong link between these fives. And there's a strong link between these fives. Look at that. And there's a strong link between these fives. That's fun. Um, that feels intentional too, but it's all it's all in one stack, so it, it, that doesn't really do anything. I think all I've really proven is that fives are limited to two places in both of these boxes. That's a lot less interesting than it than implies. <laughs> Sorry about that. Yeah, so let's look more at let's look more at fives, because five in this box is limited to two places. And five in this box is limited to two places, and they're connected by this strong link. So fives can I do anything else about fives? I don't see how. 
Are they? It, does five, five does not have a have a buy local in this row? Strong, weak, strong. I feel like he wouldn't have made this strong link unless it was important. Okay. What else can we do here? Because I'm not seeing it. So we think about it like as if this were the pivot, because if this is five, that's not five. But that not being five makes that five. Yeah, I mean, that's all we're really saying is it's just normal box logic. So I don't see how that's helpful right now. These end up with a buy local just from the simple fact that they're limited in this whole stack. Um, so maybe not as intentional as I thought. Really felt that way. Three, six, nine. So six. Six is by local here. Ooh, maybe we're doing sixes. So this six can't be here. This six sees here, and this six sees here. So we have by local sixes here, and we'll make those yellow. So now we have these sixes to work with. Are sixes limited anywhere else? Not really. Is six isn't even limited in this box. It's just too by local. So that would be a weak link. And then this six would be a strong link. And this six would be a strong link getting messy. Um, there's a weak link to the 9 with a strong link to this 9. So if we use th this by local 6 as a as a pivot. If this is 6, That doesn't that, that makes this a six. So if this is six, that's six. Otherwise that's a six. Making that a nine, making that a three. Doesn't seem to do anything. Okay, I'm gonna clear all the the <laughs> it's getting distracting. Okay, this one's not as easy to spot as as Shy's puzzle was. Um, let's keep looking. Maybe five is not by local. Um, all right, so it looks like this puzzle defeated me. Not too surprising. That's probably going to happen more often in these. Um, so probably what's going to happen is I'm going to attempt puzzles. I might uh, not find what I need to find. Then I'm going to investigate, <laughs> uh, ask people whatever needs to be happening. Um, and then come back with what is likely the intended path here. So from this state, we actually do have it. It's really hard to see. L wings are crazy. Okay. So and indeed, it is an L wing that we we're supposed to find. So here's here's what we're gonna we're gonna use. We're gonna use this strong link on these threes. We're gonna use the weak link between this three and five. We're gonna use the strong link. <laughs> Sorry, it's hard to draw long lines because of my mouse pad. Oh my gosh. We're gonna use a strong I'm gonna redo that one just because oh my actually I have I have a line tool. Why am I doing it this way? We're gonna do a strong link between the fives, then a weak link between this five and this six. And I think I do want to do arcs for most of these, but we'll do a strong link between these sixes. Okay. So do you recognize the wing pattern? Strong, weak, strong, weak, strong. That is still a wing. And you may still be confused as to, like, what the heck, how is this doing anything? Anyway, I'm going to circle the beginning and end here. So 
this chain is telling us that either three is true or six is true. Now look at this craziness. This three has a weak link to this six, and it has a weak link to this three, right? This six has a weak link to this three, and it has a weak link to this six. So if this three is true, then this six is not true, and this three is not true. If this, uh, the only other option, if this three is not true, we follow this chain. Let me, let me just walk through this. If three is not true, this three is true, which means that five is not true, which means that five is true, which means this six is not true, which means this six is true. So if this three is not true, this six ends up true. This six has a weak link to this three, and it has a weak link to this six. So no matter whether this is three or this is six, this cannot be six, and this cannot be three. That is crazy. So we eliminate that. That's not, oops, I meant to go to center my part. There we go, that's not three. And now because this isn't six, remember we did have a bilocal in this. So that's a six, that's a nine, that's a three. I'm following my bilocals. We get this eight. This isn't six, but I don't think it was bilocal in here. So that just that just puts a six in one of these two. Um, so I can get rid of yellow, I can get rid of orange. Okay, so from here, what are we doing? Um, threes are in one of these two. Okay. Um, what did I get? I got this six. I got this three. We learned this isn't three, but there wasn't a buy local on threes other than this one. Um, this three does look in here. It makes a one three pair in here. Oh no, sorry. This box already has a three. What am I doing? My brain has melted by now. Um, okay, what are we doing though? What did I get? The three, the six? Is that not enough? I think it's enough. Um, Threes look into this box. This three looks down. So three is in one of these two. Let's look at this column. We have one, we need two, we have three, we need four, five, and we need eight. Two and five are gone, five's gone. So five in this column is in one of these two. That means it's not here. Five's not here, five's not here. Ah, uh, so five is by local here. <laughs> um, was that not the step needed? <laughs> is that uh, do we need more? Um, You want more than that? <laughs> In this row, we need one, five, seven, nine. The nine in this row. There we go. That's not a nine. Oh no, yeah. And this nine sees here. Yeah, because we got this eight. So now that's a nine. That used up a one. That gives us our bilocal for the two. Okay. So I should get rid of the green and the gray before they confuse me more. This isn't a nine, which I've been trying to clear for a bit now. Um, okay, so we just got a bunch of digits. In this box, we need two, four, and six. The six can only go here. This is two or four, that's a pair. So this is eight or nine, making a pair. These are three, four, and seven. The four goes here. The three goes here, the seven goes here, because we had all this, yeah, you know how to do Sudoku. Uh, we've got this three here. These three are four, six, and eight. Okay, it, it does look like we're, we're doing well now. Um, I think it's gonna be basics here. This isn't seven anymore. Five, six, eight, nine. This is not a lot of those. Five, six, eight, nine. This is not the six or the nine. What else did I get? This is one, five, seven. Hmm.
What else am I missing? Interestingly, whatever this 248 ends up, it's going to be over here in this box. Because we don't have two that we don't have a 248 given in this box yet. Um it's not the two, right? These twos point down. It's not a two. Um so these are only from 148. Because we have the two and the five over here. Okay, it's still holding on. <laughs> what else do we have here? This box needs one five. Wait. Oh, it's five digits. Yeah. One five six seven nine. So this is only one five seven. In fact, the whole row is one five seven. It's not five, that's not one. One seven pair here, that's not a seven. Um, right, and the one seven pair takes one out of there. The rest of this column, we have the one. We need two, three. We have four, five. We need six. We have the seven. We need nine. Okay. Not two, six, not three, nine. Okay. I feel like there should be something in this box. Two is in one of these two. Mark. Actually, two is placed. There we go. This two looks down. These two twos look in. And the two is pointed down. Yeah, so that's the two for the box. I'm not sure how much that helps. But what's left in the box is four, five, six, seven. Th okay, so seven now. Yeah, we have this. Yeah, none of these are seven. The seven looks down. This seven looks in. This seven looks down. So we can place the seven. Giving us the one and the five. That was, unfortunately, that doesn't transfer by the buy local. We found the five there. Uh, that does give us this five, though, which gives us this three for the buy local. So I can get rid of that. I can get rid of the fives here. Okay. We're just down to one buy local left. <laughs> I'm going to keep it around. Um, we're not going to need it for the solve, but it'll help speed up my, my finish here. So that's seven, that's one. That's not a one. We have a two, three pair here giving us a four and a two. That's a five. We get the eight here, the four, the nine and the eight. That's the six. That was our last buy local. All right, so that's five, that's six. None of these are four. Yeah, so this four ended up here, right? So that's a one, four pair. Um, The two, five, eight triple removed, whatever was there other than one, four. This is um an eight. For the row, this is a one. For the box, this is a four. Um, what else can we fill? This nine down here, that's a three. That gives us the nine, the two, the three, the six. Places the six in the box. Okay, over here we need a one and a two. So that's the two, that's the one. We get the four and the one. We get the eight, the five, and the two. The eight and the four, the seven and the five. This is the four. We need a seven and an eight. Wow, yeah. It took me a long time. You might <laughs> the time might not match the video because I spent a while <laughs> looking to see what to do. Um so yeah, uh let me know how like do you think that I should attempt to do these live and then like do what I did here where if I get feel like I'm very stuck and not going to find it, just figure it out and then come back? Um do you think that I should just be doing walkthroughs on these where I already know how to solve it and I walk you through it? Um, let me know in the comments what you enjoy. Um, as this series continues, uh, it, there's no guarantee, as you saw here, that I'm going to be able to find what I'm looking for. Um, should I look up what I should be looking for first? Let me know what is most enjoyable to you, what helps you learn the most, what's most entertaining. Um, and yeah, so I'm very interested in your comments. And of course, if you enjoyed this in any way, why not leave a like, subscribe, and a kind comment below.